hello coders i hope you are coding well in the previous video we created workouts chart on our angular dashboard and in today's video we will create activity chart so let's get started so in our angular application we need to open dashboard.component.ts and in this file we need to go to the create line chart method and in this method we need to create a new chart after this workout chart so let's copy this code and let's paste it here and after this we need to update the ctx of this chart and instead of workout ctx we will use activity ctx and after this for the type we will keep this as line and then we need to work on the data section and in the data we need to update the labels and in this activity chart for the labels we will show all the dates and to do this we will remove this workouts and we will use activities and after this we are applying map and we are getting the data and then in an arrow function we are using date pipe dot transform method and in this we are passing the date of the activity and then we are passing the format as month and day and with this the code for the labels is completed now we need to work on the data sets and in this activity chart we need to show three data sets and the first data set will be calories burned second will be steps and the third will be distance covered so first of all we need to update our first data set for the calories burned and in this we will keep the label as calories burned and after this for the data we need to update the variable and instead of workouts we will use activities and then in the map method we are just getting the calories burned from the data and after this we will give the fill as false and the border width will be zero and at the end we will update the background and border color and with this our data set for the calories burned is completed and now we need to create a data set for the steps and to do this first of all we will update the label and we will replace this duration with steps and after this in the data we need to update the workouts and we will replace this with activities and then from the activities we need to get the steps so in the map method we will replace this duration with steps and after this in the arrow function we will call data dot steps and at the end we will update the background color and the border color and with this our data set for the steps is completed as well and now we need to create another data set to show the distance and in this data set first of all we need to pass the label and we will give this as distance and after the label we need to pass the data and to do this we will use our activities variable and then we will call map method and in this map method we will get the distance and after this we will write an arrow function and in this we will write data dot distance and with this our data is completed for this data set and now we need to give the other properties and for the fill we will give this as false and for the border width we will give this as two and at the end we will give background color and border color and with this our code is completed to show the activities chart and now let's save this file and let's run our application and as you can see our application is up without any errors now let's go to the browser and let's validate the functionality of our activities chart and in the browser we will click on this dashboard menu and as you can see on the dashboard we got recent activities chart and in this chart for the labels we are showing the dates on the bottom and after this we are showing the calories burned in the red color and as you can see for the date 7 12 i have calories burned as 500 and after this in the orange color we are showing the number of steps and as you can see for the date 7 26 i have the steps as 1000 and after this at the end we are showing the distance in the pink color and as you can see for the date 7 12 i have the distance as 14.5 kilometer and with this our fitness tracker project is completed in angular and spring boot and if you want to add more features in this project you can let us know in the comment section